Hey, good afternoon. It is a Saturday, uh, November the 13th, 2021. Anyway, I'm going to review uh, Scooby-Doo Night of a Hundred Frights just for you on the PlayStation what? 2. No, I'm not going to keep rhyming, but uh, here we go right now. i show you a little of the plane, of me playing. So here we go. Hold on. Just one second. And let's go. Hold on. I think it's all blurry. Okay. That's probably as good as it's going to get. And let's play some of Scooby-Doo Night of a Hundred Frights. So there's Shaggy and Scooby-Doo. And now I have to throw him up. So I'm throwing him up. Like Scoobs, what are we doing? All right, fuck this. All right, so here we are. This is Creepy Crawlies, or the I think Creepy Crawlies hallway, if I'm not mistaken. So there's Scooby. We go outside here. We got Toil and Trouble right here. A gargoyle. Because, you know, what it says more about uh, Scooby-Doo than Gargoyles? So we'll go right here and see what this is. Just want to let you know, this is a lot better than the uh, previous PlayStation game, which was on PlayStation 1. Uh, it was Scooby-Doo and the Cyberspace, which, you know, wasn't a bad game. I mean, I could play through it, but um, this is a lot better. As you can see the, the graphics got killed right there. There's my Scooby Snacks. Oh boy. That was another horrible Scooby impersonation. There I am getting some sandwiches. Right. Just again, the, uh, the animation. There's a fish. Alright, big fish collecting a drumstick keep away from those guys and there is a person in a trench coat not the one you guys see from Columbine this one's much scarier here we go so let's see if I can defeat this guy and you see all the cool moves Scooby has you can run him like a, a football player I just died oh well do a lot of other things with Scooby. Uh, right here. I'm gonna do some more, get some more Scooby snacks. Oh, I'm dead again. Yeah, fuck. But I'm resurrected just like Jesus Christ. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna try it one more time and uh, keep on fucking up. That's all right. There's a sandwich. Okay, you get the sandwich. Good stuff. Oh, that damn big fish keeps on getting me. All right, got some cake. Back to the guy in the trench coat. Is he going to flash me and show me his dick? I don't think so. Scooby-Doo. Shit. Scooby-Doo. Where are you? I'm right here. As you can see, this is a very good game. That's how he squashes opponents. That's how he runs into his opponents. 
Damn you, fish. But now I got some cake. It's all good. Okay, I want to show you how to beat this guy, but uh, it looks a little too hard. That's what she didn't say. <laughs> all right. Oh, and I got the guy in the trench coat. Now he can't do anything. That's right. He can't show me his thing, and he can't blow up a building. Where am I at now? Oh, well, I've already been here. Uh, let's see. I go back over here. Scooby Snacks. Damn it. Well, that's going to do it for us today. And that's going to do it for the review of uh, Scooby Dooby Doo and a hundred. Night of a hundred frights, as you can see. It's a very good one. Uh, I'd like to play more for you. But here, let me just list off some of the uh, features. 12 huge levels based on classic Scooby-Doo cartoons. Run, Scoob, says Velma. All our favorite Scooby-Doo voices, including special guest stars, are here, including Don Knotts. That's right, Don Knotts. Uh, where is everyone, says Scoob. Encounter 20 classic Scooby-Doo villains, including the Black Knight, um, as well as Geronimo, a gargoyle, a witch. Uh, the list goes on. So uh, I'm going to keep on playing this. Right now I'm 50%, uh, uh, about 50% the way through. Um, but I'll let you know when I get to the end, all right? And again, that is uh, Scooby-Doo for the PlayStation 2. Night of a Hundred Frights over here. Ray's video, just $1. Seven-day rental. I give this an A+. This has been Jake Reviews, and I'll see you on Jake's Bounty. Uh, you guys have a good rest of the weekend. Be good to yourselves and be good to each other. All right, let's go for some more Scooby.